Okay, here we are with another CZ Dubs draft. It's been a while, but school's more important. Usually that is. This is an interesting pick. Uh, we have an amazing Marsh Casualties, but we're passing Hideous, and I hate these situations where someone will see the Hideous end and think, ooh, black's open, and, you know, take it and start moving into black. But pretty unfortunate. Uh, we'll just have to deal with it because that being said, it's not worth passing Marsh Casualties for, I don't believe, because that car is such a bomb. So we'll hope to table maybe, oh, I don't know, Bloodseeker, maybe a Puma, um, possibly a Bushwhacker. Who knows? We go anywhere over here. So let's take this Marsh Casualties and get on with the second pick. All right. We got some pretty good green. We got Nisus Chosen and Haro. We passed a um, Grazing Glade Heart. So not too big as signals, but having a Heart Stabber Mosquito there is pretty good too. Um, Uncommon's gone, so Trusty Machete or Nighthawk could be gone. Any other things as well. I like staying on color, so we'll just try it. Heart Stabber Mosquito. Huh. Two Heart Stabber Mosquitoes? Now, some of you people that just hate black and love green are thinking, oh, first pick uh, Grazing Glade Heart, second pick Haro, third pick Grazing Glade Heart. I'm doing great. Um,. That's your play style. I try to play fairly consistent, and that's not a very consistent strategy. And heart stabber mosquitoes are good, so so are Haros though. Getting up to those heart stabbers. Lots of into the royals. Huh. Well, we've already passed enough green to where I don't see. Moving into green is right. Um, red doesn't seem that open. Zektar Shrine isn't that big of a signal. and Looks like we're kind of a control one. So I'm willing to take a uh, into the Royal over a Zektar Shrine. Just to see where it goes. And the Royal is pretty good. And uh, who knows. I don't like a... Uh... Huh. And there's a bunch of white cards. Take that archive trap. <laughs> Go in the middle route. <laughs> Green seems to be very open. And unfortunately, I don't think we will get rewarded for moving into green. Well, pack two. Unless we took that Haro. And it looks like that was the play. Maybe I underestimated that. Over or overvalued heart stabber mosquito. Um, hey, he's definitely going mod green to the left, so we'll just keep shipping him that and I guess take a core sanctifiers. No, we'll we'll take a on color blue card. And of course, I completely miss it again with that step links, but we do pick up a soul stare. So doesn't look that great right now. Because he was a core outfitter. Hmm. Is cancel or bog tatters here? Not looking that great. Hopefully we'll get shipped the black in uh, pack two. That's all I can say. I think I'd rather take the bog tatters here to be honest. Yeah, we're definitely in the wrong colors for sure. So we need to do something about this and start picking up some white cards, I guess. Because 
paralyzing this grass for not really that big of a signal, but I don't know. Who knows? Pillow fear locks and core cartographers don't really tell me to go into uh, any certain color, so who knows? We'll just play the control route here. Sure, we'll take a rare. Not looking good at all for us right now. Not where we want to be. Alright, how about a 2-2? Two -two? <laughs> We're kind of desperate right now. Yep, green's really open. I know. I know, green's open. You don't have to tell me. Yeah, but green's open. Stop telling me that. Ah, uh, but we're going to open up Malik the Blood Witch and get there. <laughs> Look at this awkwardness. Did I... <laughs> did I stop picking things? Ooh. Alright. <laughs> then this pack is ridiculous. It's got Lorthos. Which actually I've never played with. Seems like it could be good, but eh. Maybe we got Hideous in. I trust Machete. I really would hate to have passed two Hideous ends. I know everyone thinks Trust Machete is all amazing and stuff, and it is. And it's just. I think it's right to take the Trust Machete over Hideous end. Cause we don't even know if we're we're black. I mean, we have a couple things, but yeah, passing it up on the hideous end is fine by me. I'm I'm thinking trust Mache is going to be more important. That card is just amazing. All right, so we have disfigure and a mind sludge. I don't know how black we're going to be, we may, I don't know, I don't see us tabling the Mind Sludge since it's coming from our left. We have Nisa's Chosen for our mono green deck that we're building mentally in our heads. And a Soul Stare Expedition. We don't really need to, I guess uh, in retrospect, uh, since we are more of a control deck, uh, Hideousin would have been better. So, I think, um... That being said, I really don't know how many swamps we're going to play, so I'm going to take the safer pick and go with the disfigure. <laughs> Kraken hatchling. Then we get just a whole bunch of good red. I'm going to do you guys a favor and hide the green here. Sorry about that. Hide bad cards. Not necessarily a bad card there, but um, gosh, we almost need to take the Kraken Hatchling, or we could take this Refuge, fix our mana. Really don't know what's going on here. It's already looking terrible. I mean, we could splash for red, but yeah. Let's just fix our mana. We'll invest in that. And there's another Haro. And a Step Links. And nothing else for us. We're going to take the Haro. Holy crap. Oh my god, green. Green, white. No one picked up on the signals. So now everyone's going to try. Because everybody's trying to force black. Just like me. <laughs> Somebody screwed up.
I mean, what is this Timbermall Oliver doing here? Seriously. What are you doing? I passed so much good green to the left. What are you doing here? Ugh. Fine. If no one's going to take green, I'll freaking take green. Ticks me off. <laughs> Go all.